Lady Love, shout out to you. She said, Six tried to use her femininity as a weapon and it backfired. You guys, this is someone who watched the stream. So she pulled out a victim card. She even went on her channel, carrying in <laughs> that a married man would save her, but her so-called man was beside her. I didn't say it. I didn't say it. You guys, someone saw what happened. She's telling you exactly what took place, you guys. This is what's going on. Performative femininity. It's dangerous. Chameleon in nature. But I like to say performative femininity. It's more professional. I'm not going to call a woman a chameleon. But performative femininity. Yes, absolutely. Let's dive into it. Get this triggered. woman off the panel. She is a, she is, everything was wrong with the black community. No, She's you, so now I'm everything that's wrong with the black community. When he. Shout out to Miss Creative. She said, everybody in relationship dating expert these days, and most of them sing, uh, single, single, single. I mean, listen, if you're teaching women how to be more feminine, how to get and attract a man and you yourself are not married. Using hypersexualized photos of yourself, putting yourself in all these provocative images and putting them out online. Uh, it's not, I don't think that's feminine, man. That's not, at least, at least not. You know, you guys have to understand how men think. You're either for. You guys, ladies, listen, men think in two ways, right? We're very simple, right? We're either going to sleep with you or build with you. That's it. There's no in between. You're either good for sleeping with or you're good for building with. That's it. And a man sees a woman and identifies her value. He's going to build with you. A, woman, a man sees the qualities that you bring and how you can help lift that man up, amplify what that man is doing. You are a woman that can be built with, right? We can build with you. Then there are other women who are just, you guys, I don't make the rules. That's how men think. We're very simple, ladies. We're very simple. Very simple. You can flaunt around your image and who you think you are and what you're, you're qualified to get or whatever. You can do whatever you want to do. At the end of the day, many either play with you or they build with you. All that other stuff about you being this height, your image this, all the photos, whatever you want to do and talk about. FBA, MBA, W, whatever, whatever. It doesn't matter. Many are either going to play with you or they're going to build with you, ladies. That is the harsh reality. Stop investing and wasting time with men who are not building with you. It's just that simple. It's that simple. That's how men look at it. And a lot of times, unfortunately, you have a lot of women who think because they're attractive that they can get a lot of men doesn't mean you can keep the man that you're getting. Right? Quality over quantity. Which Pick, pick your poison. Pick your poison. Beauty curves, all that height, whatever. Skin complexion means nothing. It means absolutely nothing to us. If you're not a man's peace, right, then you're a man's prison. Shout out to my homeboy. He says, show me a dime piece and I'll show you 20 men that didn't want her. It has nothing to do with your looks. Absolutely nothing to do with your looks. Are you a man's peace or are you his prison? It's just that simple. It's just that simple. Men are either going to play with you or they're going to build with you. Uh, and if you are who you think you are, then you should have had three, four rings. You should be running a Super Bowl, sis. You should be running a Super Bowl right now. That's just my, that's just my, you know, big brother to a little sister, right? Now, one would argue she's not married. She has a kid. Can she give advice? In my mind, I think she can give a lot of advice. Ladies do the opposite of what she's doing. 